Hey everybody, Arbitrary Gamer here, and we're back with Democracy 3. We're gonna load our game, which I believe I saved under cool, because obviously, Democracy 3, I think is very cool. We also have an autosave, I don't know what that is. We're gonna be working off of cool, so. Uh, we're back as President of the United States of America. Nothing new has happened in the United States. We're buying votes, we're lining up retirement directorships, preparing sound bites. Fiddling ministral expenses. Wow. Our system is pretty corrupt, but I guess that's how politics works these days. As you might remember from last time, vigilante mobs is at an end. It's gone. Health is going up. Crime is going down. Unemployment's going down. GDP is about the same. I guess we have a superhero. Bunny man, it looks like. And credit rating downgraded. Everybody's all mad about that. Sorry, guys. 61% of the vote in an election, which is very good. Budget report is CC. Uh, I really don't know what that means. I wish I did. CC. Hmm. And there's some more down here, but... All right, so we're probably back into our game here. You might remember we're very good in technology. The U.S. Uh, if you live in the U.S., obviously... You probably know that we have some of the biggest technological advances. Not saying that anybody from any other country is. It's just pretty down on our tech. Uh, vigilante crimes is gone. We're working on crime and alcohol abuse. Uh, alcohol consumption, all of that. Crime in general, which is a big one. As you'll see, influenced by a lot of things. And so is unemployment. As well as GDP, if we come over here. This stuff is, like, huge. Uh, state employees about to pee their pants. Conservatives probably are peeing their pants. Poor are doing okay, retired. So let's try to work on the people who are mad at us and that will pretty pay, uh, important in an election like the parents. I'd say probably 75% uh, of people, probably even more in the US are parents. And that's a lot of the vote and as you might remember handgun laws was a big one on parents but it costs a crap load to raise and lower and we only have 30 little fisty things so we can't really do anything with that uh now we could work on some of these things that uh are negative issues that'd be good to get rid of altogether like the asthma epidemic so how about we focus this episode on alcohol consumption abuse and the asthma epidemic as well as trying to boost up our GDP overall trying to make hey, uh, parents and everybody in general better so let's see the asthma epidemic is being positively impacted by car usage and the hard thing about asthma epidemic the reason it's really hard to get rid of is because as you can see there's no white bubble things so there's nothing that we can just change that will just bring this down there's a lot of things that we have to do so car usage, road building, uh, petrol tax, car tax. Let's try to go with some of these um, some of these white bubbles that we can easily change. So let's take a look at car tax. That's a good one to start with. Car usage. We want car usage to go down. And it's gonna take us 18 to raise. It's not gonna. It's gonna cost us some. No, it's not gonna cost us any, and it's gonna give us impact. Uh, it's gonna give us income. I'm sorry, but it's not very popular. It's pretty fast to implement, though. The car usage thing takes six turns to delay. We might want to bring that down to maybe right, right about there at high. Maybe even a little bit more. Let me see. All right. And let's apply these changes. What a name, Howard Howard. That face. These people look like they're forcing their faces so much. He looks like he has like a cork up his butt and he hasn't pooped in days. I feel really sorry for that dude. So, so sorry, Howard Howard. It's a really, really odd name. I wouldn't name my child Howard Howard. But I'm not saying anything against having a child who's named Howard Howard. 
That'd be kind of cool, I guess, to have your last name the same as your first name, maybe. Or maybe not, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so let's apply the changes. 12 little fish things left. That should help the parents, and that should also get down with the asthma epidemic. What else can we do to lower car usage? Petrol tax. Let's take a look at that. And if we bring this up, we have a lot of income. But motorists are going to be really mad. Car use is going to go down. We should probably bring this to about... What do you say? Like 40? 40%? 45% I say is pretty good. And environmentalists are going to be happy. Very happy. Motorists... Uh, hate us and GDP is going to go down ever so slightly so that's uh, uh oh hold on it's going to actually take us more to raise than I thought so let's go to our next turn and then we will be able to raise that so we crime again going down pulse we went up 1% I guess that's pretty good health is still going up cabinet is loyal Oil drilling opportunity. Let's take a look at this. Oil companies are are keen to get permission to drill for an oil in a part of the country being protected as a wildlife refuge. The oil supplies under the refuge are considerable, but drilling would have a negative impact on the environment. So pretty much oil is what makes our country run. And... It's also going to make us money, but if we don't drill oil, we're going to be helping the environment, but how would our economy sustain itself? That's my view on it. Let's take a look at the first few sentences. Allow drilling. Billions of barrels of oil right here on our soil, and the current law is preventing us from drilling it. Or importing oil from other countries. Yeah, that's not good. And this valuable wildlife refuge would be devastated. I'm gonna have to go with what will help the economy because I don't think taking oil for like 20 times the price over in another country is the best thing I mean yeah we do have oil right here in like our backyard but I guess we're burying it and saving it till like the end of time when we're never gonna use it so that's good uh, and yeah let's go so what we were looking at last time was Car usage and pet petrol tax. Was this one it? No, that's sales tax. Here it is. And we still don't have enough by one. <laughs> Great. What else can we do under car usage then? That will bring this down. Hybrid cars initiative. That's a really good one too. And pretty much bringing this up is all good. Except it's going to cost us a little bit more quarter. Very popular. Howard Howard. Help us, man. All right, good. What else can we do? Let's see. How many uh, thingies are we getting each turn? We're getting uh, 23. And for the thing, we needed like 23. And for the, we need 36. So that means we need to have about 14 left by the time we end this turn. So we can still do a lot more. So, let's go back to alcohol abuse, which is being positively impacted by alcohol consumption, obviously. Obviously. And it's hurting a lot of things. It's helping a lot of things. Have we messed with alcohol law yet? Let me see. Strong restrictions. Not popular with voters, but it'll bring down alcohol consumption. I don't think we should maybe do it that much. I think we should do it right there, because youth will be mad, of course. Violent crime, liberal. We don't want to make things too mad, and it's fairly unpopular, so we don't want to lose too much popularity. So let's apply these changes. Betty Patterson, Miss Vampire Lady, come on, help us. All right, uh... I don't know if we're going to be able to find something under 18. I mean, under four or five political capital things that we can do. 
We can take a look though. It's always worth trying, I guess. Uh, anything else under alcohol consumption that we could do right now? Not really. So let's take a look at our GDP too. That one's pretty important. And as you can see, this is probably the biggest one in the game. And capitalists are impacted a lot by it. Let's see if there's anything that would that is helping it and that we could raise for a little bit of stuff. Let's see here. Science funding, technology grants, small business grants. Let's take a look at small business grants. Uh, four to raise, which is perfect. And it'll help self-employed. Socialism will be hurt and trade unionist members. But I think if we raise this to the top, I think that'll be pretty good. So why don't we apply those changes? Julie Washington, come on, man. Well, well, man, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to call you a man. You don't look like a man. I'm sorry. All right, uh, 14, which should be perfect. 23, yeah, we should be good. So let's plop on to our next turn. And as you can see, at the beginning, we were going kind of slow, but now we're kind of zooming through things. Pointing friends to jobs, spoils, compiling misleading statistics. Crime is in a green. Wow. Health is in a yellow. GDP hasn't really nothing. Unemployment, we didn't really do anything with. We're doing good. Polls still 62% in election, but crime is almost down. And I already got the achievement crime for Utopia, I think. Antisocial behavior is now at an end, too. Yay. That's another thing. Good. For some reason, I can't direct. Oh, this time I can. Still loyal. All that stuff. Cool. So now we should have enough to... Let's take a look at the asthma epidemic. How are we doing? Yeah, we haven't really done anything. Uh, car usage. I think we can look at that patrol tax this time. And we do have enough to raise it. So... Uh, I think we are talking about 45%, which is pretty good. Howard Howard. This is a pretty big one. Do you think you can handle this, dude? I think you can. Let's read it. Taxing fuel can be a huge source of income for a government and can also be seen as a green policy by encouraging people to drive less or to use more fuel efficient cars. Uh, critics suggest that this is just another chemical tax on the motorist and some complain that the alternative public transport is not a viable option for everybody. It's not really, really popular, but I think it needs to be done to get rid of the asthma epidemic, which is kind of what we want to do. So let's apply these changes. We have one little thingy left. That was a really short turn. Uh, parents. How are parents doing, actually? They're getting a, a little happier since when we first started. They do not like drug addiction, and they do not like the asthma epidemic, which we're really trying to bring down. So let's go to our next turn. Patronizing the electorate, compiling misleading statistics. Crime, down, health again, up. Message from your minister. Uh-oh. Betty, what do you need? Betty, no. Betty is currently working as your law and order minister and is displeased with current government policy, which is unpopular with their core supporters. As a result, there is a danger of minister wanting to spend more time with their family in the near future. Uh, that pretty much means she's going to dump us sometime soon. She's not very loyal. We might want to do that. Doctors have warned us our business is really stressed out. Oh my gosh. That kind of looks like the dude from the Stanley Parable. Little Stanley. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, that means we need to bring that down. Uh, 59. We went down a little bit, but that's because of the patrol tax. Uh, yeah. I guess we should probably continue. Uh, how's the asthma epidemic going here? It's going down, it's going down. That'll probably take a few turns to fully implement. So let's do some stuff that'll bring our popularity up, like implementing policies. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, and why don't we look at economy, because that's fairly big. And let's look at one that's popular, so let's just scroll through. Organic farming subsidy. I think that's like the only one that's pretty popular. Supporters of an organic farming say the state should subsidize a method of harming because the perceived health benefits of food. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, potential costs, a lot. Not too, too much, but a lot. And what's it going to do? Uh, it's just going to make... What about tax? Do we have anything there? Married 
allowance tax popular just trying to look at the ones that are most popular health tax school tax why don't we take a look at this married tax allowance and let's implement it popular and it'll make parents more happy which is good and we can raise it and lower it all we want so let's apply those changes we have two little fist things left so we can't really do anything else so i think we're gonna stop it there we'll see what that did the next time uh we did a lot this time we got rid of the stress epidemic vigilante crimes is gone asthma epidemics going down how about ep alcohol consumption that is getting close to the stop trigger and that was really high too so that's really good cool and parents getting happier so it's pretty cool uh as always i'm arbitrary gamer Facebook and Twitter are down in the description. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, as always. If you guys like my videos and you'd like to share them, by all means, share them. I'm just like you guys. I'm a 14-year-old person who likes YouTube, and I just like entertaining people. So I hope you guys are being entertained. Caesar's Palace is coming, as usual. If you guys have any other series that you would like me to start or recommend, just post it in the comments or message me on Twitter or Facebook, and I will be sure to reply to any comment. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.